And hey guys, welcome back to the channel, back with the Midwest Express. So today we're talking about our old friend, Ship Shopper. And I haven't done a video on Shipped in quite a while. And the main reason why is I've... Shipped has an Achilles heel, which we're going to talk about. But before we get into that, I want to tell you why I think you should sign up for Ship now if you're not already a Ship Shopper. So... Target announced this week they are going to launch a grocery delivery service to rival Walmart and Amazon. So this is going to be a new player in the in the game. Now they already had ship shoppers that would shop for groceries and whatnot, but now they're really going to be promoting the memberships and doing the grocery delivery aspect of drivers just picking stuff up as ship shoppers as well. So this is another avenue that they didn't have available before. So with this, this new service that's going to revamp the old Target Circle, but they're going to have like Circle 360 and have like three tiers of membership for people. But the top tier will, you know, for deliveries of over $35, they will have free two-day shipping on bigger items and, and extend delivery services for same-day delivery services for their customers. Now, the membership is going to take effect April 7th is when they're going to ramp up this new program. So now is a good time to sign up. And this is just my humble opinion, guys. This is just my recommendation to you. This isn't sponsored by Ship or Target. I'm just taking a look at what possible opportunities there might be out there with this new upgrade. So... They're going to charge their customers $49 for the first year if they sign up before May 18th. If they don't, then the customers have to pay $99 a month. And that's very similar to what Walmart does. Walmart does a monthly one where they pay $12.95 a month to have the services, or they can pay $100 for a whole year, which is what I do because I use Walmart Plus because I get gas discounts and a lot of other benefits that kind of go along with it when I am not driving for Walmart. Smart. So Amazon has Amazon Fresh, Walmart has Walmart Plus, and now Target is going to have Target Circle 360. And I enjoy delivering for Shipped, Ship Shopper. The sign-up process for Shipped is fairly easy, straightforward, just like all the gig apps. They send you a t-shirt. Uh, back in the time, they sent you hand sanitizer and masks. We turned the whole COVID thing. But I really enjoyed shopping for ship because shopping at Target is a little bit easier to find things. They have everything laid out in the app. It's fairly easy to do the whole routine of shopping for ship. Here is the Achilles heel with ship, though. And there's a there's actually a couple. The first one is they do not tip up front. Uh, ship shoppers do the shop first and then you uh, get the tip afterward. Now, if you do a very good job of your service and you take pride in your delivery and you're not just ramming and jamming, <laughs> the customers can pick you as a preferred shopper. So once you start building your customer base with ship, it's awesome. But the flip side is, is if you get bad reviews from a customer with Ship Shopper, it will not send, it, it demotes you. You don't see the bigger batches. It's it's an Achilles heel with Ship Shopper, which I really, it's a, it's a rub. That, the t not seeing the tips up front and the customers having such a heavy weight on the delivery driver. So, those are the only two bad aspects, I think, of ship. But as far as app usability and, and whatnot, I think that it's a very easy program to use. And I really, I like delivery for ship, but it's, it's not the biggest moneymaker, but it's another tool for your toolbox. And with all these drivers coming out, I think the more tools you have in your toolbox, the safer you'll be in this current economy. And uh, hopefully you guys get some value out of this. Make sure you like, subscribe, and we'll hit you on the next one.